location with OutdoorFL.com. The topic for today is countertops and outdoor kitchens. Well, outdoor kitchens can have lots of countertops. Poured concrete, granite, marble, tile, porcelain, ceramic. We love them all in specific situations depending on if it's exposed, depending on your budget and what you're trying to get in terms of aesthetic finish. What we love here on this outdoor kitchen is we're going to use a beautiful marble, home marble countertop with rectified edges that's larger and leaves um, as few grout lines as possible. We don't like grout lines down here in Florida. It uh, attracts bacteria, it's porous, it can get dirty, you know all the reasons. Um, carefully choose your countertop. Sorry about the background noise, can't stop uh, progress. Carefully choose your outdoor countertop according to your budget. For example, there's over 200 square feet here. At $40 a foot with granite, that'd be $8,000 in cost to you. Um, you've got to balance out that cost and the aesthetic look and function. I'm sure your contractor will help you work with that. If you're going to do something like this, try to pick out something that really accentuates the outdoor for your environment and the flooring. For example, you can see this is a marble. You see a similar kind of substance so that we're not introducing too many substances out here and making it too busy. If you're going to do something like this at your house, find a licensed contractor, take your time, and do it right. It's Kevin Keen on location and the topic for today is roofs on pergolas. Well, we've got a roof on this pergola that's going to protect us from the rain, but we've also wanted to finish this off with a ceiling. I love tongue and groove. I love run, running it the long way to make it look deeper. And I love staining it with a special treatment that allows it to bond and create almost like an acrylic finish down here in Florida so that you don't have to restain it every five, ten years. That's important to us. If you're going to do an outdoor ceiling like this, make sure you include lighting. This lighting in this case, what we have is over the bar area and over the kitchen area. It'll all be on a dimmer switch in addition to a fan that will circulate the air on hot days like we get down here in Florida. If you have any questions like this, consult your local contractor or us at OutdoorFL.com. And remember, it's your home. Do it right.